Hi, I'm Jonathan Schein, practice leader of National Real Estate Investor Magazine, NRAIOnline.com, a dependent sustainability initiative, and we're at the 2013 ICSE Retail Green Conference hosted by the ICSE in Phoenix, Arizona, and we're fortunate to have with us Tim Backstrom, Director of Facility Management for Staples USA. Welcome, and he's also, excuse me, President of the Professional Retail Store Maintenance Association, of which uh, has taken a big part of the Retail Green Conference. Thank you. Uh, Tim, why don't we talk a little bit about uh, what uh, PRISM, as it's known as, brings to the, con the Retail Green Conference in general. Yeah, I think uh, you know our, our, our presence here, particularly this week, is to, uh, is to partner uh, with Retail Green uh, and uh, really um, use this as a networking opportunity as well. Uh, you know, certainly we released a, 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 a press release on uh, sustainability and best practices, and this very, very nicely ties into this uh, Retail Green Conference. I understand one of the things that was released this week is an RFP tool for the waste management aspect of your tenants, work for your tenants. Maybe you want to talk a little bit about that. Yeah, I mean, you know, I think for, for many uh, years, um, RFPs in general, I think, uh, are specific based on the retailer, uh, the format, uh, the language, uh, and so on and so forth. It is great to have a tool uh, like this, um, this RFP, uh, particularly for waste management, so that um, our members can, can really, um, you know, uh, have consistent uh, information to deliver to the vendor uh, when bidding out, you know, particular waste management. Well, it's a big prism. It's a big prism initiative. I'm sure your company is also participating with the RFP process? Uh, we participate with an RFP process. Um, you know, certainly we uh, cannot, we won't be taking immediate advantage of, of this tool uh, because you know we're, we're locked into a, to a contract currently. But certainly, when the time comes, uh, this will certainly be a tool that you know Staples will participate in. It. And so, what are you what are you gaining other than what your the networking aspects? What kind of uh, knowledge are you taking away from Retail Green this year? Um, you know, the sustainable practices that, that how um, certainly for, for me personally, how some of these folks that attend the Retail Green Conference. Um, some of them do cross over to facilities management as well. I mean, in the end, um, you know, a lot of companies um, have a separate sustainability uh, department and a separate facilities management department. But in the end, uh, both groups work very closely together. Uh, if it's, you know, if one group is scoping uh, out a, a project, so, you know, perhaps some of the folks here this week are, are looking for, um, you know, scopes uh, for energy savings, uh, for, you know, waste pickups, right sizing, things like that. Um, a lot of the facilities management groups may be the ones that are ex actually executing that. I think it's a true partnership, regardless of whether they're, uh, you know, they're separate departments. And for me personally, this week it was great to uh, to, to uh, certainly meet with a lot of new people and uh, see a lot of new faces to, uh, you know, make some future connections with. And it's also interesting to meet potential competitors without actually competing with them in the in the same realm. All right. Well, Tim Backstrom, really appreciate you spending a little time with us. Uh, enjoy the rest of the conference. Thank you.